Good day everyone! My name is Justin A. Saranda from the Z1F. So for today's activity, using the language of love, I need to find out the love language of the five person who are very close to me and insights on the importance of knowing and understanding one's love language. Before we start, let me discuss first the five love language. We have five love language which is words of uh, affirmation, acts of service, receiving gifts, quality time, and physical touch. Let's start with words of affirmation, words that communicate your love, appreciation, and respect for another person. By simply saying, I love you, is you are showing your love to your loved ones. The second one is acts of service. Action is louder than words. Acts of service is a language that can best be described as doing something for your partner that you know they would like watering their plants, or cooking them a meal, when you give acts of service, you give off your time just to be with that person. The third on the list is receiving gifts. If you or your partner's love language is gifts, that means you feel love or that you're demonstrating your love with a tangible item. The fourth one is quality time. Quality time is the one that centers around togetherness. It's all about expressing your love and affection with your undivided attention when you're with your partner. You put down the cell phone, turn off the tablet, and focus on them. The last but not the least is physical touch. Refers to expressing and receiving affection through touch, physical closeness, and other forms of physical connection. Kissing, hugging, holding hands are all ways of showing love through the physical touch, love language. I am very proudly to introduce to you the five persons who are very close to me, which is my friends, to know and understand their love language. After answering the language of love quiz, I check and evaluate the score that correspond to their love language and I get to know what is their love language. My friend Angelica, her love language is acts of service. My boy best friend Eric, his love language is physical touch. My dear friend Alana, her love language is quality time. My second boy best friend Matthew, his love language is physical touch also. My friend Charlene, her love language is receiving gifts. It's very important to know and understand the love language of other people and your loved ones. It can help you recognize their methods of expressing love so that you can feel loved and valued even while you are aware that their methods are different from your own. And now that I know my friend's love language, I can fully express my love for them, I can fully understand them, and we can create more strong bond bonds together. Knowing your loved one's language and letting them know yours is a way to help you both be loved and appreciated. We can understand each other, and there will be no barriers to our friendship. The way that a person prefers to express love to and receive it from a partner, friend, or from other people.